Yeah, that's true. If you've just turned on the TV, it's been a very impressive display from South Africa in this third one-day international, the Daffa News Cup. They went 1-0 down in the second game. And they were asked by their captain to show some character. And these are some of the highlights of Quinton de Kock's beautiful 100. He's played straight, he's been classy, and he's given South Africa the impetus that they needed to get back into the series. Yeah, shots all around the ground. As per usual with Quinton de Kock, plenty of power, plenty of precision, full of elegance. Never makes it look difficult, I tell you. Very, very easy on the eye when he stands at the crease. A couple of biggies down the ground. He's been committed to a stroke play. Very good through and over offside. Actually played nicely over extra cover today. Going nicely. Eh? 102 with power to add. Just an African keeper. Well, if there are any cracks, they're starting to open up a little bit, and it's understandable. Josh Little at mid-off, misfields one, and it's uh, it's a disappointing start after the uh, drinks break. Quits the clock, trying to go over mid-off. Josh Little just gets his feet slightly wrong. It's up and away. Sixer. Strap yourself in. This could be an entertaining passage of play. Have a look at this. Look at the extension of the arms here from Quinton de Kock. Nothing but full commitment to the stroke. Never tries to keep this down. He has one intention and one intention only. That's hitting a six. What a brilliant shot. Slight change in field, I think. You just wonder whether Doc will could potentially come around the wicket, change the angle, get him to play across it. Left armour taking the ball away from the left-hander. Difficult times for Ireland. He's gone again. Has he got enough? And he has. It's into the marquee. The player's marquee, and that goes for another six. It's back-to-back -back sixes. It's raining sixes. Well, serious pressure on George Dockle, who is nothing more than a part-time bowler these days. Doesn't quite get it all there, Quinton the Cock, but it's not a big boundary. Favourable area for left-handers, that cow corner. They'll keep going there, I think. Well, this is where the confidence of George Dock is going to be called into question. That was the first ball I've had. This is a beautiful shot, lovely extension of the arms. George Dockrell, who burst on the scene in 2010 as a very young left arm spinner. Played some county cricket at Somerset, lost his way with the balls, turned himself into a batsman, reinvented himself as a batsman, now more of a part time bowler. Well, he's been put under pressure. Milan now, a 99 not out. Come on, Ireland, bring the, bring the field in. They did it the previous over with Simi Singh. Bring them in. No! Yes! And that'll be it. That'll be it. Well played, Yanomar Milan. Second hundred for South Africa. Well played. Excellent, excellent batting. Has supported his senior partner, Quinton de Kock, very admirably and well deserved. Yes, lovely moment for Yanomar Milan. Very highly regarded all over South Africa. Dominated domestic cricket for a long time. ODI 100, number two. ODI century, number two. Brilliant knock. A pretty fierce over that from South Africa. 225. Ends the 36 